الحمد لله وكفى وسلام على عباده الذين اصطفى اما بعد يا اخوان المسلمين السلام عليكم ورحمه الله وبركاته بركه مو ده ساكي هدوا a wannan shiri namu na takaitaccen tarihin sahabban annabi sallallahu alayhi wa ala alihi wa sallam a yau muna tare da sahabiya wacce ake cewa asma'u bintu abi bakar ato nana asma'u yar abu bakar as-siddiq radiyallahu anhu wannan sahabiya sahabiya ce mai daraja kwarai mai falala kuma sanan an haife ta shekara ta 57 a uh, kafin hijira annabi sallallahu alaihi wa alihi wa sallama kuma haifaffar makka ce kuma kamar inda muka ji abubakar as-siddiq shine mahaifinta yar uwar na na aisha ce amma ta girma na na aisha da shekara 10 sha wani abu wato akalla ta bata shekara 10 da wani abu sai dai malamai suka wari sabani wajen sha na wani da haka ta girma na na Aisha da shekara 10 sha wani abu kuma ta karbi musulunci tun farko farkon da'awa a lokacin da ta musulunta mutane sahabbai ba su kai 20 a duniya ba dan haka ta shiga dinin musulunci dan haka kake tana cikin as-sabiquna al-awwaluna min al-muhajirin wal ansari to haka ta taso kuma dama ga babanta shi ma shi ya fara musulunta kuma haka ta taso gidansu cikin musulunci a uh, wato ainihin tare da mahaifinta daga bayan kuma ita ce ta auri az-zubair ibn al-awwam shine wanda suke aurin auren saurayi da budurwa da shi Allah ya kare da a gare su a gaba da kuma ta kasance ne matuƙar biyayya ga mujinta az-zubair ibn al-awwam a lokacin da ta aure shi domin takan ba da labari ta ce miji na az-zubair lokacin da na aure shi ni nake fita na je ne yau wa dokin sa ciyawa sannan ni nake yin faci a jikin guga idan ya yage dan haka ne jawo ruwa ne faci a jikin guga ne yi dukkan abin da yake na hada hada ta gida dan haka ita take yi shi yasa da wannan malami suka ci ashe hidimar gida gaba daya akan mata take dan haka komai mace ita za ta lura da shi na gida shine asali to haka ta zauna kware da gaske wajen biyayya ga mujinta ta taimakawa annabi sallallahu alaihi wasallam matuƙa lokacin da yi hijira wannan da manzan Allah sallallahu alaihi wasallam ya hijira ya ban Makka to ba madinan direct ya tafi ba sai ya boye a wani kogo da ake kira kogon Thauru da shi da Abu Bakar akalla ya kai kwana uku a cikin wannan kogo to anan ne ma ita nana Asma'u ita ce aka tsara take kawo wa manzan Allah sallallahu alaihi wasallam da mahaifinta Abu Bakar abinci har ma sai ta samu dan kwalinta sai ta raba shi gida biyu rabi ta daura aka a matsayin dan kwali rabin kuma sai take daure abinci wanda take kai wa annabi sallallahu alaihi wasallam da kuma mahaifinta Abu Bakar to shine ma har manzo Allah yake tambaya ta ina ta samu wannan abin da take daurewa ta ce ai dan kwali na ne ne tsaga shi guda biyu to shine manzo Allah ya ce to ai kuwa ina tabbatar miki da cewa zaki samu irin wannan dan kwalin a gidan aljanna to shi yasa ma ake mata laqabi da zatun niqaqaini wato ma'abociyar fatala guda biyu kuma wannan bishara da manzo Allah ya mata cewa za ta samu kuma bishara ce ta cewa ita yana aljanna ce to ita ta dinga zirga zirga wajen kawo abinci aha aka gama wannan zaman manzo Allah ya tafi zuwa Madina wanda ita ma daga baya ta yi hijira ta koma zuwa Madina din to haka ta koma duk saboda imani da annabi sallallahu alaihi wa ala alihi wa sallama kuma mujinta shi ma zubair ibn awwam ya hijira kuma ta yi hijira ne tana dauke da cikin Abdullahi ibn Zubair amma a haka da cikin tai wannan tafiya din kuma ita ce ta fara haihuwa ma baya daga cikin mutane da suka yi hijira daga maka suka koma Madina da ma yahudawa ma suna cewa ai sun daure cikin matan musulmai ba wacce za ta yi hu kawai sai ya zama bayan yan watanni da koma sai Allah ya sa ita ta yi hu shi yasa ma dan nata Abdullah ibn Zubair sahabai suka dauko shi suna kabbara suka fito titi suka kai shi wajen annabi sallallahu alaihi wasallam manzo Allah ya yi masa ta haniki sannan kuma ya sa mai suna Abdullah shine Abdullah ibn Zubair Allah ya kare yadda a gare su gaba da to haka nana asma'u ta zauna yana daga abin da yake nuna maka imaninta shine abin da Imam al-Bukhari ya kawo cikin al-adab al-mufrad cewa 
wata rana kawai sai ga mahaifiyarta ita mahaifiyarta bata musulunta ba ana kiran ta Kotaila to sai ta sai ga ta kawai a Madina to da ta ganta tace to gaskiya ni yanzu ba wani abu da zan miki sai naji na tambaye manzo Allah ce ya halitta a matsayin ki na kafira ni ina musulma in kula ki in taimaka miki da ta tambaye manzo Allah ya ce yace sili rahimaki ki je ki sada da zumuncin da ke tsakanin ki da mahaifiyarki to sai da ta tambaye manzo Allah sannan ta zo ta yi masauki da kyautatawa ga mahaifiyarta ta haifita wannan ko ba shakka yana nuna baka sabar tsoron allanta da bin Allah da kuma takatsantsan irin nata to haka na asma'u ta yi tsawon rai kware a wato akalla ta kai shekara 100 a duniya amma hakorinta ko da bai cire ba amma kafin ta rasu ta makance ya zama wato ainihin ba ta gani ta rasu wajen shekara ta 83 bayan hijiran manzo Allah sallallahu alaihi wa alihi wasallama lokacin Hajjaj bin Yusuf bayan ya kashe danta Abdullah ibn Zubair tsakanin rasuwar danta Abdullah ibn Zubair da kuma rasuwar ta bai wuce kwana goma zuwa sha wani abu ba wasu malamai su ce sati daya wasu kwana goma wasu sati biyu wasu sati uku shine mafi tsawon abin da dai aka fada tsakanin rasuwar Abdullahi danta da kuma ita rasuwar ta Allah ya kare yadda a gare ta subhanakallahumma wa bihamdik ashhadu an la ilaha illa anta astaghfiruka wa atubu ilaik wassalamu alaykum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh